and then we'll do maybe like a nose from, what is this? Surfboard, this is probably a board that someone dropped off for a ding repair that I thought would look cool. picturing something like this. Okay, okay, I know what to do. Wow. That is fun. I'm gonna pull the planer out, see if we can make it look a little bit more like a surfboard. At this point, I don't even know if I'm gonna glass this thing. Foam. Eyeball. Foam. Yeah, it's gonna come down a little. Okay, this is kind of looking good. But this needs to come in like, dude, it needs to come in. It's getting better, it's still weird. Does that look symmetrical? I think so. Yeah. Use this. So it kind of comes up like that. Pile up all these logos on the tail. I'm gonna do that. I'm gonna glass it like that. Hitting that lamp everywhere, and we'll be picking colors and putting resin on.
was like a really light green swirl. People have different methods here. I just like to cut right into it, straight down. Yep. I'm gonna use a Posca pen and just freehand a pen line around my cut line. Shoot. Oh, that's just too big. Well, there's two more dots in. Let's see that. It's pretty sick. Basically, I'm just gonna pour where you want resin on your finger before the trick. And when you roll it back, just want to make sure you get it. Cause my neighbors. Okay, I got an idea. I went on a rug website and took like screenshots of some rug patterns. I think these will look really cool on uh, on the fins. Really sick, like I think this one's pretty cool. Cool pattern, um, but I kind of want to make this color like blue or green. So if we do like, oh yeah, that's sick. Go. Yeah. to put more layers of fiberglass on that. So, okay, so I make the new mask on. Cut a good out. Give it like this and like that and like this in it. There you go. Yeah, with the UV light. Okay, well. It's. always hot coating you got to be really clean um can't brush your hot coat after you put it on i ruined an entire board doing that had to learn the hard way so take it from me don't brush your resin after you put it on the board the other thing you want to do is just try to rub your brushes together if you just don't want any loose bristles ending up on your board One more time around the border of the board. Make sure your reels are saturated. 
and that's it. Feels good. Looks good. Thanks. That's it. That's it's it. It's done. it right up to the nose so everyone can tell that you throw fat air versus usually my foot's like right about here dude just kidding i've never done an air reverse in my life i'm a kook well here it is the finished product five foot Yee-hee! <laughs>